It's what you hear it, listen. It's what you hear it, listen. X go give it to you. Wait for you to get it on your own. X go deliver to you. Knock, knock, open up the door, it's real. With the non-stop pop out and stay the still. Hey, what's going on, guys? Swarm of X bringing a game of domination on uh, bootleg. And we're going to be spawn trapping the team, the enemy team at A. I usually get behind these little crates right here. And I get like four or five kills off the bat real quick. That's what I usually do. So I just sit here and chill. And right now, I'm waiting for my teammates to show up so they can back me up. And then I move my way up the stairs where I finish getting the rest of my kills, which is uh, about nine or eight. I think it's eight. Yeah, eight. So I got my eight kills real quick. I think it's like probably like two minutes into the game. And I already got my first Reaper. And then now it's just time to make sure these guys don't get out like right there I fucked it up and my teammate died because of me because I couldn't protect his uh, body when he was uh, I think he was shooting a predator not a predator the um, javelin I think that's what it's called yeah the javelin he was shooting the javelin into their spawn point that's what you gotta do see right there he's shooting another javelin and I helped him out right there get his javelin off but now he's on his own you know which I think he's still alive but as long as I keep him away from seaside I'll be fine because usually these the guys I play with don't really like to go there to sea so I just gotta keep the pressure at sea seaside plus I get a bunch of assists and it leads into my other kill streaks so that's always good but yeah that's basically it you know uh, and I have no idea why I, I dropped those care packages off on top of my body when they're just gonna be able to crush me and kill me and end my streak but I wasn't thinking at the time, I just wanted to throw those out as soon as possible. Just to cause a lot of noise in the air. And usually when uh, your team flips the spawn on this one, on this map, it really sucks. Because the position that I like to hide in, that little, behind that little box, it's not really a good one. Especially when your uh, enemy team is spawning right behind you. Anybody can clearly see that you're just laying there if they're not blind. So if that happens to you when you use the same little spot, uh, make sure you just keep the pressure in the back of C. Those those two back buildings that sort of people like to spawn at. I know for sure they spawn inside uh, the building right next to C. If you spawn, if you spawn rape them too much, but that's why I didn't move right away. Make made sure that there is nobody around me to ruin my kill spree. So right now they're spawning over here in the back of C. So I'm just gonna hold uh, this position down for a bit and just make sure basically clear clear out the the enemy team and then they'll eventually start popping out back at their a spawn but yeah that's about it guys you know it's not that hard you just gotta have a good team that listens and doesn't flip the spawn but we usually don't care we'll flip it anyways just because we can but always be aware that the spawn can flip at any moment so use portable radars in certain locations around sea 
and uh, you'll be all right. Unless they're wearing uh, ninja, I mean not ninja, assassin pro. <laughs> I don't know why the hell I said ninja. I guess because it looks like a ninja, but yeah, if they're wearing assassin pro, you're pretty much screwed. So even if you have the the portable radar or whatever, it it helps to have it in certain maps like resistance and this map but I didn't have it yet or I, th I think I didn't have it yet I didn't I didn't put it yet but on uh, another map I used it on resistance because I would usually be on the top of a uh, C on resistance it's like a little building where you can see all the way to that little sniper staircase that people like to snipe that's in front of me once again, you see me stand up slowly, use the box. That guy got mind fucked right there because I ducked right when he turned the corner. That marksman going to work using my flashbang. Flashbangs are your best friend. I got my Moab right before I died, so that was good. And we're gonna. I didn't want to use that. I want to call out my Moab to clear him out of C and start the spawn rape again. Like I said before, you only want to use Moabs when uh, the enemies get out of control and they break free. And it basically just resets the whole game for your team. So, I don't know if we're going to capture C or what but I think my teammates didn't want me to capture C just to let the game go on longer so we could just get more kills and that's usually what we do we give them two positions and we just keep going back and forth I think I said that already before but but yeah that's basically the same strategy for every map uh, you only use Moabs when the enemies uh, get out of control or use the Moabs whenever too many people have Moabs because sometimes like six of us would have a will have a Moab and people will be uh, calling them in at the last couple of minutes of the game and some people don't even get to call out their Moabs because of the timer the 10 second timer I think it's 10 seconds or is it 5 seconds or 10 seconds for the Moabs to explode. But anyways, that little time period of the countdown, uh, people will be trying to call in theirs right after, and uh, the game will just end, and they don't get to call in their Moabs, so they don't, they don't get the, uh, the bragging rights, I guess, saying that they got a Moab, because anybody can say they got a Moab, but you know, you didn't call it in, so. We don't know you got a Moab unless we checked your score and you went 25 and 0. But yeah, that's happened to us a couple of times. It's happened to me for sure, where I was about to call in my Moab and then somebody else called it in and it was like 197 points and I couldn't even call it in because the game ended. Well, I had called it in, but the game ended before the damn. Moab popped. So, just, I guess if you're not playing with a team and you get your Moab, just call it in whenever, you know. Uh, make the tryhards quit out, because, you know, you usually get those uh, level 14, I mean, level 20 prestiges that are in random games that are just running around with the PP90s and they're just trying their heart out. Especially against whenever they see like a clan or a team. They just try all hard. Using their tactical insertion. Sometimes they'll even use rockets. Because they know you're they know you're going to be spawn trapping. So they're just going to try to ruin your game as much as possible. And then they, they keep following you in all your other matches. So basically when you Moab them. They instantly quit out. And that's the funny part I think. And right here I get fucked up. 
and now I'm just calling out like my uh, kill streaks because the game's about to end, so I don't really care anymore. But anyways, uh, that's that's basically what you gotta do if you got a try hard in the game. Is just just get the Moab as soon as possible and just blow it as soon as possible, and that will clear out any try hard. Um, because no 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 try hard wants to get Moab, so they just instantly dashboard or quit out, and then you get your your fun game you now. Goddamn dagger rush, ra rushing the spawn points. But that's that's usually what we do. Is just we try to Moab as soon as possible to get the tryhards. That's if there is tryhards in the game. You can you can you can easily find these guys at the start of the game. Whenever they got their Your little clan tags, or their just by the way their name is, they always have some stupid, ridiculous name that's like XI No Scope XI or IX. You know, I'm pretty sure you guys seen those guys that have those stupid names like that. Or it's faggot, it's cocksucker, it's it's if you have an ITZ in your name. You're a fucking piece of shit and you suck dick. It's bitch. It's Moab time. It's Havoc. It's Jacob. I hate motherfuckers that do that. Anyways, once again, here's another video for you guys to watch. Hope you enjoyed it. Comment, subscribe, peace. I went 84 and 2.